Martha Enriquez. I'm with the Claremont County Health Department. And I am so glad to uh, have so many people come to the Safe Communities Mocktails event today. The goal of this event is to promote sober driving. We're doing it around Halloween this year because it's become such a big party holiday, especially for the young people. And UC is just a great avenue to have it in with so many young, uh, young adults that might be out partying. So we're here promoting sober driving and all these booths folks have thought up drinks to offer at parties that are non-alcoholic and try to reduce traffic crashes so thank you uh, my name is maria rebush and i'm with rumkey i'm actually their graphic designer and we are here to promote the don't drink and drive message it's uh, very important to us we reach out to our communities and uh, get that message out there we like to promote safety we have the Rumpke Sunrise. It's very good. It includes sugar, cranberry juice, pineapple juice, uh, ginger ale, and almond extract. It is diet root beer. Okay. And uh, vanilla yogurt and chocolate yogurt. Yogurt. And gummy worms. And gummy worms. So tell me more about that. The Slammer Saver has orange juice, lemonade, pineapple juice, fresh bananas, and ginger ale. This will keep you from going from bar to bars this Halloween. My daughter Katie Hommesser was also a student at University of Cincinnati. Um, she got her undergraduate degree and her master's degree from um, UC and she was a language speech pathologist. In 2006, she was killed by a drunk driver um, heading home from Children's Hospital with my granddaughter in the car. Katie was killed by a young boy underage drinking all day, and um, he had a Ford pickup truck, hit her head on, killed her instantly, and my granddaughter was put in the hospital for a month. Because of that, our family's lives have completely changed. And so, Martha asked me to come out and speak to you today. You're my first engagement. I figure after six years, it's time to get out here and promote um, no drinking and driving. Uh, we started a foundation called uh, the Katie Hommeser Foundation in honor of Kate, and we are working diligently to open up a place called Katie's House um, with the Hearing, Speech, and Deaf Center down on Burnett Avenue, who will, um, we will have a place where children with all kinds of disabilities will receive not only speech therapy, ideology, occupational therapy, social workers will help the families, regardless of uh, their ability to pay. So something good is happening, but if we can stop the drivers from drinking before they get on the road, then my family would not have experienced such a tragic loss. I am so excited to be able to present this award with our other two judges. And, officer? And I want to thank our our other judges, too, is Lieutenant David Doyle from the Sheriff's Office and Bruce Gibson from uh, the Criminal Justice Program here at UC. So it was a very hard decision, but we decided that the overall award should go to number six, um, the Alley Health Department.